Greetings, everyone. Glad to have you with us on this Wednesday night edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Hall of Famer Doris Burke and Greg Anthony giving us the rundown from the sideline courtside, David Aldridge. Now, a look at Dallas's starting lineup. The star backcourt of Doncic and Irving are out there. Washington out there with Daniel Gaffer. And it's Thompson in at the three, the small forward. And for Los Angeles, at the guard positions, Russell and Reeves. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. And it's Hachimura in at the small forward position. Tip-off goes to the Lakers. We're approaching the trade deadline, GA. How do teams decide if they're a buyer? It comes down to goals. It really your timeline. So some teams make deals to try to push them over the top this season. Others might find a player they love and trade for him with the future in mind. Wow, you see the physical defense against Luka didn't even matter. He powers right through it. To the paint, stolen by Washington. Gafford, high post. Washington against LeBron. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. What a terrific play by just a tremendous all-around player. This guy makes it look easy. Credit where credit is due. P.J. Washington is one hard-working guy on the floor. Isn't he great? He's got that grittiness to him, Kevin. Values every chance he gets to affect the game. And like you said, he puts a ton of effort into his play. Well, for P.J. Washington, it's important he continue to establish himself as a floor spacer. This guy can really make threes. Now here's James. His last outing, he had 24 points. No good there off the double clutch. Thompson passes to Irving. Tries from 10. It's deflected. LeBron kicks to Russell. Over Doncic. Gets some rim on the way. And the bucket's good. And the poise of D'Angelo Russell, despite the size all around him. That's nice. And now, just over a minute played here in the first. To the middle. Here's Washington. And then Washington with the dunk. Well, not exactly one of those big, burly power forwards, right? He depends on his leaping ability more than those guys. And it serves him just fine. And it's good for two. LeBron James just reads the floor so well. If a lane opens, he will exploit it and get to the cup off the drive. Here's Doncic. Got a piece of it. And James picks up the foul. That's his first foul. And way to get there first and be willing to absorb the contact. First team foul. Russell against Doncic. Always going up for the alley-oop here. And Gafford throws it down. They see the Luka attention Luca draws. That's why his teammates get so many wide-open looks. That's to Hachimura. Picks it out to James. Russell from long range. Not going to go that time. The Mavericks have gotten four of six field goal attempts to drop in the first quarter. And it's Doncic missing. Lakers have gone three or five shooting the ball so far. Reeves the pass to James. Doncic with the block. Boy, Luka has decided he wants to become a more complete defensive player. How about twice on the pipes? And so the ball out of bounds. Davis touched it last. First quarter of basketball, just over two and a half minutes play. So for Dallas, their last game, a loss to the Pelicans. Back to LeBron. Here's Reeves. Yes, and it's LeBron picking up the assist. LeBron James with the assist. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Mavericks. Three-point lead. Last time they met was in Dallas. 
Yeah, for that loss, you can credit their defense or lack thereof. Too many breakdowns on that end of the floor. Well, the kind of low energy effort they played with all night will make a coach absolutely crazy. You can't win if you don't play quality defense. Well, that's not the guy you want guarding him at the rim. Just too much of a differential in terms of size. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. Greg, what a remarkable run from the Dallas Mavericks in that 2010-11 NBA season. And some say it's the toughest title any team has ever won. When you consider the juggernauts they took out, including the victory of the Miami Heat in the NBA Finals. Now here's James. He's a player that you can only hope to slow down his he averages nearly 28 points a game. Not really his best quarter as far as scoring. Let, let's see if he can eventually get back on track. Now, here's Doncic after LeBron James's miss. Here's Gafford. And terrific work on the offensive glass, and he picks up two. Gafford's got six. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Mavericks. Uh, how about the ferocity we have seen from them on defense? I mean, they're looking to contest every shot that goes up. Another big component of their early game tonight has been points off turnovers. Great job converting on those chances. Good work there as it goes. LeBron's got his second basket. Well, we always talk about the power of LeBron James, but how about the grace on the pull-up there? And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. That's on LeBron James. The Mavericks shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. First free throw is good. And Los Angeles with some changes. Radish, he's checked in for Rui Hachimura. Christie comes in for Austin Reed. And it's Gabe Vincent in for Russell. Now here's LeBron. Pass to Vincent. Takes a three. It's rebounded by Dallas. Gafford's got his fifth rebound in this one. That's his fourth basket of the game, and he's only taken four shots off to a good start. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Vincent. No good on the three. Yeah, but the defenders draped all over him. He just could not shake loose. To the left side wing. Now, here's Hardy, defended by Vincent. Four on the shot clock. From deep, Washington. The pass to Hardy goes back up, and he hits Hardy. the jumper for two. They've been beating them to a lot of those loose balls and rebounds here to start. Vincent with it. Still yet to score. And he drives in. Here's Marshall. That's tipped. Here's Davis. Draws contact on the shot. And now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. The foul couldn't hold Davis down. His scoring ability is just that strong. And Los Angeles with some changes. ABC comes in for Reddish. And James up in for Vincent. And Dallas calls their first time out of the game. For viewers, timeouts, a chance to check your phone, grab a drink, but for the teams, it's all about business. Well, there's something that the coach doesn't like. I'm curious to see which kind of adjustment he makes here. And Los Angeles with some changes. Christian Woods checked in for Davis, and it's Reddish in for Christian. Mavericks leading Two by five. Two minutes in the first. Two minutes. Hardy passes to Lively. Here's Eubanks. Here's Grimes. And the first shot of the night for him, no good. It's picked off. Here's Eubanks. James covering. Kicks to Marshall. He lobs up the alley-oop pass, throws down the alley-oop slam. Oh, and the lead gets bigger on a ridiculous offensive sequence. That dunk alone would have been spectacular, never mind it coming at the end of an alley-oop. James outside. And here's Wood outside. 
Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. James has got five assists in the game. I'll tell you, how about the hustle and the muscle by Christian Wood? Go ahead. And he's got his first chance at the line here. 114 left to play here in the first. They double him with LeBron. Pass to Lively. Here's Grimes. And there's the whistle. Illegal screen. And a great time to check out the power rankings. See how the teams are stacking up across the league. You look at the Celtics. They're gaining on some of the teams above them. Trying hard to crack into that top five. And when you look at the Lakers, they just can't seem to find the mojo they need to move up the rank. They tinkered with their lineup, but so far they just keep getting the same results. The Mavericks leading. Pass to Eubanks. And down it goes. Dunk through off a wonderful assist. And this game already taking shape as an offensive battle. Well, the fans love it. Coaches may not like the lack of defense, but boy, the rules promote scoring, no doubt. James misses. Dallas leading by three. Here's Lively. And it goes down two points. Yeah, three consecutive field goals from. have come right Party. at the rim. The D had better start buckling now. Puts one up from 19. And the Lakers take hey. on two more. Dallas has gone 0-3 from three-point land. Nothing yet going outside. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Here's Grimes. Hands it from downtown. Yeah, off to a strong start here early. Six points off second chance buckets. James, the bounce pass. And James gets the ticket on the assist by James. LeBron's got his third bucket of the night. Here's Grimes. And that one released in time. And, and so it's Daniel Gafford making highlights for the Dallas Mavericks. Scoring, rebounding. He was all over the place during that quarter. They are riding his performance right now. We'll take a quick break and then back to the action here. Just tuning in, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. And what do you think, guys, about Dallas here in this one? Well, one way to generate more offense, pound the offensive glass. That was the difference in the first. I love the determination. They want to go after every rebound out there and overwhelming to the opposition right now. LeBron is checked in for the Lakers. Hachimura comes in for ABC. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Dallas. Kyrie Irving comes in for Hardy. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. At the guard positions, Russell and Reeves. And it's Hachimura in at the three spot. That's the Laker five. Now here is Hachimura. Coming in off a 10-point performance last game out. Just five on the clock. LeBron against Washington. LeBron finishes inside with authority. And nothing gets past LeBron. I mean, make some play before the clock runs out. Doncic against Russell. Gafford kicks to Irving. No good with the triple. And so it's Davis. He'll bring the ball up for the Lakers. Their next game playing at home as the Nets come into town. And that's the third of four straight played at home. Thompson finds Washington. Back to Thompson. Oh, Thompson, tough shot. And great, we still see players embellishing contact. Is enough being done to discourage those creative flourishes? We're talking about flopping, right? I mean, we're seeing the Lee experiment assessing a technical free throw. It's necessary or guys will keep jerking their heads and falling down. And who wants to see that? Hard work and soft hands, guys. That, that's what made that play possible. No simple offensive rebound there. Going for the tip-in. Donjic bullies the D inside. 
I'll tell you, Luka Doncic makes tough shots look easy. Boy, that close to the bucket through that much contact? Nice. From deep, James. And it's Clay Thompson with the rebound. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the three. We think of Thompson as a beautifully gifted shooter, but make no mistake, he understands when and where to place the basketball when a teammate is open. Here's Russell. The Mavericks making the shot. Here's Davis. And the rejection by Kaffer. Here's Irving. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Now it's a six-point Dallas lead. Oh, great ball movement there. Russell passes to Reeves. LeBron outside. And it's Hachi Murray in the corner. And they call the foul. So a chance at the line for one more coming up. I mean, that's about tremendous body control Defensive right there. You love that Hachimura willing to accept the contact. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. You know, on the season. Second team foul. You know, only shoot. That's the reason on the court. One fifty-six left in the first half of the game. Poked away. Hardy passes to Eubanks. Here's Lively. He's guarded by Davis. Passes to Hardy. Six to shoot. And he hits it just before the shot clock expires. Hardy's got five points now this quarter. And that's ten straight points in the paint. The defense, nowhere to be found. James has a two-pointer. Make it five for ten with him in that bucket. Oh, the rhythm and timing for LeBron James. No hesitation off the catch. You love to see it. Mavericks leading by 15. Inside. Here's Eubanks. Well, what he lacks in size for a this typical center, he makes up for with all that athleticism. Boy, can he elevate. Here's James. Oh, the strength of LeBron. I'll tell you, what a night. He has been efficient. He's been strong. Unfortunately, they're still fighting an uphill battle. 56 seconds left here in the second. Hachimura comes with a double team. Here's the pass to Hardy. Now, here's Marshall. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. That's on LeBron James. It's his first trip to the line. He's off on the first. And Los Angeles with some changes. Reddish. Checked in for Rudy Hachimura. Christie comes in for Austin Reed. And it's Gabe Vincent in for Russell. For the Lakers, they won their last contest that game against the Thunder. Reddish the pass to James. And good as it just snugs right down through the net. In the mid-range, rarely the hallmark of efficiency in today's NBA, but it is on point tonight. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Hardy passes to Eubanks. And the rejection by James. He could not get that one over LeBron James. Just perfect position, great strength, and send it back, Mr. James. Here's Grimes. Three-pointer. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And so it's the Dallas Mavericks enjoying a 12-point lead as they talk things over during the break. They've had such great ball movement and shot selection, and it's led to a terrific field goal percentage. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thank you, Kevin. Here with Coach Jason Kidd. Jason, how do you feel about your team's performance? I feel great. You know, we're sharing the ball, we're making the extra pass, but we're attacking the paint. And if we can continue to do that, it puts us in a good seat. Jason, thanks for your time. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. And we'll be back for the third quarter of action following halftime. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. 
Hey, everybody. Welcome to the 2K Sports Halftime Program. I'm Ernie Johnson alongside Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith. Luka Doncic has been the story in this. He had 12 points, two steals, and one block. Let's start with you, Shaq. What did you think about the Mavericks? What stood out to me more than anything else was how hard they got after it on the offensive glass. They were keeping possessions alive and converting points. Take away those extra points, they're not in this position, Ernie. And Kenny, let's get your thoughts on the Lakers. Guys were getting burned up. They wouldn't put a hand up. As my man down, man down. Oh, we got to get him some help. That pretty much covers everything. No way, no way. And... And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. What can you say, LeBron James? What an impressive effort today. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate within the first few quarters. And one of the things every player is after is efficiency at the offensive end. And boy, this young guy has done just that. Well, we've got a second half of basketball for you. We think it's going to be pretty good. A big comeback, though, is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. On the court for the Mavericks. The star backcourt of Doncic and Irving are out there. P.J. Washington is out there with Thompson, and it's Gafford in at the five, roaming the paint. Here's James. Oh, a big move by LeBron. That is why the ticket price is what it is when LeBron is in town. I'm And they're bringing you up close and personal on the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. Irving passes to Washington. It's tipped. Relentless defensive energy from Rui. Able to outwork his man and send it back. LeBron kicks to Hachimura. Off the mark, had a chance to trim it to single digits. And that's the battle they haven't been winning today. Their work on the glass has been porous, and that's got to change. Second half just getting started. About a minute played. Thompson with the bucket. Lakers trail by 15. James looking it over. Pass to Hachimura. The kick out to LeBron. James cooking from deep. You call this a great coach offensively. When shots are falling, you're getting to your spots. LeBron James right now on his personal playground. So it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for Dallas. 17 points was their biggest margin. Washington finds Irving. Shot from free throw range. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. For Dallas, they have missed a few free throws up to this point, shooting 4 of 7 from the foul line tonight. I think one of the things you have to be in awe of is how creative and how elusive Kyrie Irving is to deal with when he's cooking offensively. This guy truly a remarkable talent. James checked in for Austin Reed. Now, here is Russell. Steady offensive output from him, averaging more than 16 points a game. They're doing work here in the second half. Three or four to start. And the Mavericks call time here. Man, give a big round of applause to your little youth dance team. And the Lakers with some changes. Jackson A's, he's checked in for D'Angelo Russell. Christie comes in for Hatchimura. And ABC subbed in for James. Now here's Irving. Six points for him. Off the left rim and out. 
I'll tell you, it has not been this guy's best night, but the teammates have been there to pick up. Oh, it's a great dunk. Oh, my goodness. Let it freak. Oh, my goodness. AD wanted them to feel that one. Davis boosts his whole team with that explosiveness. Dallas leading by nine. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Alder. Thanks very much. Now, the league says it wants every team to play to win, but all-star Kevin Durant said it's just not realistic, adding, each year only a few teams can win it. If you're not going to be a playoff or play-in team, might as well go for a top pick, get some reps for guys who ordinarily wouldn't make the rotation, and maybe change their lives as well. Kevin? And that's an interesting take. Thanks, D.A. Yeah, this offense is rolling. They've been assertive, but they're also playing under control. I think the communication on offense is working at every level right now. What a run for this group. That's a stomach punch, guys. Turn it over and give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. It's still close, though. These teams have been neck and neck. Let's see the response here. Now, here's Doncic, and he comes up with the deuce. Doncic has got 14 points. And the game of basketball is one of runs, and right now, this one's definitely not over. The shot is good, and the Mavericks lead has kept to just five points in the basket from Anthony Davis. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Here's Doncic. He's got 14. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. That one on Davis. And when it comes to Luka Doncic, he's simply, Greg, one of the best players in the entire game. No question about it. He's a threat to record a triple-double every time he takes the floor. As versatile and dangerous a player as there is in our league. What you love about Luka Doncic is he's this unique combination of size and skill. He can really play cross-positionally. He makes shots at all three levels so dangerous. Here's James. That one a tad off to the right, but drops in front. And the crisp passing has opened things up for them offensively. Now, Doncic, he's got 16. Puts up a deep three. Oh, Doncic from way outside. Well, I absolutely love the way this guy has controlled the pace tonight. They've been able to play the style they want. Gafford passes to Doncic. He kicks it to Irving. Puts up a deep three. And out of bounds is Los Angeles. Game's possession. And a chance here to check out some stats on Anthony Davis. Over the last month, he has been spectacular. And he's an elite glass eater, a factor inside among the top 10 in rebounds per game. He has been a human highlight reel all season long. Clearly the best shot blocker in the game right now, and he has the numbers to back it up. Back to LeBron. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. That was ball. Now that we have the chance to show you the teams in the top of the NBA in steals this year. The Lakers number one. And it's no accident to see them at that top spot, guys. I mean, great awareness and anticipation. They apply a ton of pressure defensively. Here's Doncic, and the dunk by Doncic. Well, Luka can get himself into the paint with consistency, and boy, does he make that a high percentage finish. LeBron outside. Off to Hayes. Pass to Crystal. Five to shoot. James in the high post. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. Always willing to embrace contact. LeBron James has the kind of frame that can absorb it any time. And G.A. starting next season. Some big repeat penalties for teams well over the camp. That draft pick penalty is especially tough. Yeah, I mean, if a team is over that 17 and a half million mark twice in a four-year span, their first round draft pick falls to the end of the Hardy. Here's 
driveway. He's guarded by Davis. Marshall inside the three-point line. It's going to be out of bounds. Los Angeles will retain possession. Lakers trail by nine. Russell passes to LeBron. Lakers working the ball around now. Back to Davis. And they pick up two. 19 points for Anthony Davis. Well, individually, he is doing everything he can in this 12-minute session, but he's just not getting enough help. Dallas has gotten the three-point bug tonight. They've taken 15 shots outside the arc. Six of 15. And Doncic throws it down. I'll tell you, some people question the athleticism of Luka Doncic, but boy, he loves to dunk on occasion and let you hear about it. Now, here is Russell. 143 left to play in the third. That's it. The Dallas lead is kept to just seven on the basket from James. Well, they're not behind because of this guy. He is putting on a tremendous run. The pass to Marshall. Back to Doncic. And Doncic throws it down. Well, the exceptional handle. Doncic has every move, can go in any direction. Look out, folks. James on the drive, and finished off by LeBron. A power flush with a long hang on the rim at the end of that. That could be, you know, that could be a catalyst for him. It really could. Hardy passes to Grind. Here's Lively. He's guarded by Davis. And the dunk to finish it off. Uh, beauty. And this sort of awesome dunk is one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game. Well, there's a swagger out there. You can see it on the court that they possess and are not afraid to show it either. And making it look easy. LeBron overwhelms the defense inside. 46 seconds left in the third. Donchich outside. Pass to Hardy. The shot's good on the assist by Donchich. Donchich has got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Lakers trail by nine. Loads it up for Davis. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. And it's blocked. And that's out of bounds. Dallas will retain possession. And some changes here for the Lakers. Jackson A's. He's checked in for D'Angelo Russell. Reddish comes in for Hachimura. And ABC subbed in for Austin Reed. The Mavericks also with a sub. Eubanks. He's checked in for Harden. Pass to James. And another three for the Lakers. LeBron worked tirelessly early in his career on it his range shooting and boy it has paid dividends lively and so it's the Dallas Mavericks with their lead standing at six points here at the end of the quarter they then active hands and of course they a lot of turnovers in this one and we've got more at 2k sports coming your way after this and now we have a moment to uh, reveal our state farm assist of the game and I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Well, making the game easy for your teammates. All about putting them in a position to score. That's pretty. Well, this has been a great contest so far, and I imagine the fourth quarter could have even more action in store for us. They've got ABC. He's out there with Anthony Davis. Then it's Reddish. And it's LeBron in at the one. That's the Laker five. Now here's LeBron. And the rejection by Gafford. One on one here. Here's Irving. Count it good. And look at how the hustle game has been going for Dallas. Great job by this team closing out, blocking up bunch of shots and just a tremendous effort defensively. The other thing that jumps out about their performance tonight, the amount of steals really pressuring those ball handlers. Now, here's Washington. After the miss from Cam Reddy. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. And the Mavericks lead by 10. I don't know 
what's happening defensively, but they're not putting up any resistance. Who wants call the Lakers? You have to like what you're seeing from Luka Doncic. And he's been taking it to the rack all game. They haven't been able to contain it. They haven't put up better fight on the inside. Some changes here for the Lakers. Hachimura has checked in for Reddish. Austin Reeves comes in for ABC. And D'Angelo Russell subbed in for Hayes. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Well, I had a chance to find out what Los Angeles' coach was going over with his guys. The coach is not happy with that three-point battle. He told his team, we're down because they're making more threes than us. We have to defend the line if we're not making them at the other end. Guys. Thank you, David. Now, here is Irving. After LeBron James's miss. Thompson misses. Ranchich with the steal. Passes it to Gaffer. Thompson against LeBron. And Thompson kicks to Irving. Ranchich outside. Oh, drew the foul. Almost hit the three-point bucket. And he'll go to the line to shoot three. That's on LeBron James. That free throw good from Doncic. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line of this half. James finds Davis. Oh, that's blocked. Now, here's Marshall. James defending. And here is Marshall. Knocked loose. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by James. P.J. Washington. He's checked in for Harden. Substitution. P.J. Washington. James against Washington. Six on the shot clock. And he's good on the three ball. Washington's got six points in the quarter. He's just stretching them out. The defense has got to do a better job of staying attached to him. Well, you know this. This is a guy who's looking for his shot the whole time. You have to know who you're guarding. KYP. Know your personnel. And that's where you want to make the next pass. This guy is a good scorer, but the defense was right on him. Russell against Washington. Here's Hachimura, and it's blocked. Now, here's Doncic, and there's the pass to Lively. And now they decide to foul intentionally. There's really no idea why you're fouling in a situation like that. You know, maybe there's some bad blood between those two. Hayes is checked in for James. So we see the Mavericks taking the win here. That's the A resounding victory for them. And Greg in enemy territory, no less. That's exactly right. But with the way they control the game, it, it just completely took the crowd out of it. That's how to get it done on the road. And now let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline for our player of the game. David, take it away. Thanks, Kevin. Luca, you played well and you got the win. So, what made the difference? Yeah, I think we had a uh, had a great game. You know, we had a. I think it was a great game today. You know, we step up uh, together, play good defense, and it was a great win. Thanks for your time, man. Appreciate it, Kevin. Back to you. Much appreciated, David. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Alden, this is Kevin Harlan, along with our terrific 2K Sports crew, thanking you for tuning in. We'll see you later.